Hi, thank you for visiting our website. My name is Mark. I'll be helping you review the skeletal system, in particular, the spinal cord. So let's get started. The spinal cord is separated into three different regions. First, on the top region, you have the cervical region. Second, you have the thoracic. And third, you have the lumbar. At the bottom of the spinal cord, you have the sacrum and the coccyx. Let's review. Top part is the cervical, the middle is the thoracic, the bottom is the lumbar, this is the sacrum, and this is the coccyx. The cervical region has seven vertebrae, the thoracic has twelve, the lumbar has five. Let's start over again. How many vertebrae are there in the cervical region? Seven. How about the thoracic? There's twelve. How about in the lumbar region? There's five. What's this region called? The cervical region. What's this region called? Thoracic. What's this region called? The lumbar. How about this? This is the sacrum. And this last one is the coccyx. A good way to remember the regions of the spine is to use a mnemonic. Cars that are loud sound cool. Cars, cervical, thoracic that are lumbar loud, sacrum sound, coccyx cool. Cars that are loud sound cool. How many bones are in the cervical? Seven. Thoracic, twelve. Lumbar, five. The sacrum and the coccyx. The first two bones in the cervical region of the body are special. They have their own names. The first is called the atlas. The second is called the axis. What's the first vertebra called in the spinal cord? Atlas. What is the second called? Axis. Atlas and axis. So let's review one more time. Atlas, axis are located in the cervical region. The vertebra in the spinal cord are labeled starting in the first region from the atlas C1 to C7. In the thoracic region, T1 to T12. In the lumbar region, L1 to L5. These spiky protrusions from the spinal cord are called the spinous processes. They have this dinosaur effect. This is called the spinous process. You can see these protruding spikes coming out of the spine. These are called the spinous processes. Now let's review one more time. What is this region called? Cervical. What's this region called? Thoracic. What's this region called? Lumbar. What is this bone called? Sacrum. And this last bone right here? The coccyx. How many bones are there in the cervical region? Seven. How many are in there in the thoracic region? Twelve. How many are there 
in the lumbar region. Five, breakfast is at seven, lunch is at 12, dinner is at five. Good way to remember that. For more videos and tutorials on the spinal cord, visit ICI-training.com and go to our video section to get the complete series of tutorials. Thank you for watching and good luck on the review.